Do the more. What, bitch? Do the more. Yeah, whoa. Do the more. Yeah. Do the more. Yeah, whoa. Niggas trying to flex like Mar. Like Mar. Fuck bitches, no X like Mar. Yeah, Lil' Mar, no, for real. That way. Yeah, welcome back to another video, guys. And I finally got some rims for my Chrysler 300. FedEx literally just, it's like 10 o'clock right now. FedEx just dropped them off at my house. I ordered them online. They were about uh, 600 bucks. So um, I'm about to do a little unboxing and review, show you guys which rims I picked out and why I liked them. Then we're gonna hopefully get them put on today because I have to work tomorrow. So. Hopefully I'll have time to get these put on today. I also ordered some subwoofers. Uh, they're supposed to come in the mail tomorrow, so I won't be able to put those on. To, I won't be able to put those in until next week. But I did get my rims and my subwoofers, and then my car will basically be complete. Cause what else did I get? I got my um my headlights already. So all I really needed now was my rims and subwoofers to complete the car. Like I said, I'm not gonna really do too much modding to this car. Like these are just the main three essentials that are like must haves, and when you have a car like. That's like ne the necessity. So anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys which rims I got. Here they are right here. I got the MST. They're 17 inches because like I said, I have 17 inch wheels. I mean, yeah, 17 inch tires. So I didn't want to buy new tires because that would be a waste of money. I just, I just decided to get some nice rims. Now, before I even show you these, just, just look at the color of the car, okay? Look at the color of my car. Remember, it's, it's maroon. This is the reason why I decided to get me some ruby red rims now these are just these look absolutely amazing i was a little bit nervous because i didn't know how they were going to actually look in person i didn't know if they were just going to be like bright red but they're they're actually like really shiny now these are going to like really match the color of the car as you can see i got the other two in the back seat because they wouldn't fit back here but these are going to look absolutely amazing I'm, I'm really looking forward to getting these put on i'm just wow i'm, I'm just so excited to see the outcome of this because i know these are going to look these are gonna look insane on this car. It's it's really gonna match. Like the whole car is gonna be red, and then that's what that's why I got my red headlights because like the whole car is basically gonna be red. Like I'm I'm even like considering like painting my grill red. Like I know I told you guys I was thinking about doing like a a chrome delete or getting a black black grill, but I'm thinking about just telling my body shop to just go ahead and paint this whole grill red. You know what I'm saying? Something unique, and then it'll match my headlights. So I'm about to uh, have them come pick it up for me and put these on for me. So yeah. I'll be back. We lit. No, for real. <laughs> that way. Yeah. All right. I'm back. I finally got them put on. And as you can see right there in the background, man, they look, they look amazing. Yep. There they, I mean, they, they don't, they don't match entirely with the color. Cause like I said, the color, the car, the color of the car is maroon and these are kind of like a bright red, but they definitely match with my headlights. Let me go around to the front and show you guys the headlights again. Now my headlights are like a bright red, just like that. So that that somewhat matches much better and by the way guys the, the reason why i didn't get bigger tires the reason why i got 17 inch wheels just like the size of my tires is because well if you guys remember i had size 17 uh tires on that hyundai that blue car and the tire would go flat every two weeks it, like it, I, I didn't have them for more than a month because the, after the first two weeks the tires went flat and it was under a warranty but i kept if i didn't have a warranty i would have kept having to pay 125 dollars for uh tires every two weeks and matter of fact someone had just came to the body shop today and they were they were taking off their big tires off of their car and putting on their old wheels because we have a whole bunch of potholes here in south carolina so like one pothole in your whole like if th those tires don't have that much air in the first place so they, there's not that much that they can take before they go flat so i just decided to keep the same the same tires and just get the uh the right size wheel so that this will save me money in the future i don't need to be going all out and going crazy and buying some huge tires are just going to end up getting popped but um i'm really loving the look on this and like i said my uh my subwoofers are supposed to get here tomorrow so i will definitely be getting those put on um hopefully next monday i gotta call and schedule that too but um yeah i'm really looking forward to this and that, that, like i said that's probably all i'm really gonna do to the car for right now i might do some i might get the windows tinted probably i'm thinking about getting another um throttle controller because like there's so much lag when i press the pedal i know it's not a fast car but it still like my, my camera wasn't very fast but once i got that throttle controller put in that made a huge difference so i'm probably gonna get those just the tent and the throttle controller and probably leave it at that i'm not gonna go painting getting getting some crazy spoiler or nothing like that i'm gonna just leave it as is because i mean it's just a simple simple sedan you know it's not like no sports car but um I'm, I'm having fun with it regardless so um i'll be back uh probably next week once it's time to get the subwoofers put in so no nah, for real huh that way 
yeah all right guys i'm back it is now wednesday and my uh subwoofer kit final just came in the mail today in this huge box and um so here it all is this is the amplifier well th this is actually just a wiring kit i think this is the actual amplifier right here and then they put the actual subwoofer in this box right here which i gotta open up now like i said this is the scar audio I got both the, uh, I, I bought their package. It was $500. It came with the subwoofer and the amplifier. So um, I'm about to put them in my trunk right now, but I'm not actually gonna get to put these on until like next next Tuesday. So, okay, so I just, just a little quick update. I just got it all in the trunk with the help of my mom because these were actually really heavy. I mean, obviously this is, so um, anyways, a little bit about the subwoofers. I got the, um, like I said, Scar Audio. And these are um, 2,400 watts actually, but the amplifier is only, um, 12, yeah, 1,200, 1,200 uh, watts. But the subwoofer is 1,200 watts. So, they, they, I think I think that's about how a lot of my kicker subs were, and they're also like they're dual 12s again. So, I'm expecting about about the same quality of sound, if not more. Just the speakers in this car are actually much better. Like I have a lot more bass in this car than I had in my Hyundai. So, these might actually come out better, like with my current my current speakers so i'm really looking forward to um getting this put on tuesday i already made the reservation for tuesday at ultimate audio again i highly recommend them they they do a lot of my work uh like speaker wise and other stuff not like body work but like any any uh lights and stuff like that speaker audio you know so i highly recommend them ultimate audio next gen but anyways i will be back uh next tuesday no for real <laughs> that way all right just a quick update video guys uh i did end up getting my five percent window tint like i told you i was gonna do and i've had five percent tint on all my vehicles my hyundai and my camaro so um i mean yes it is illegal it is very illegal but the cops here in south carolina do not care at all so i don't have to worry about getting put over and it makes the car it makes the car look much more better instead of having that that boring tint it's, it looks much better tinted um as you can see um especially with with the wheels and yeah it, it is very dark as you can see this is like pretty much a basically mirror because i'm standing right here and you can see me clearly you can't see nothing inside the car i mean a little bit but mostly all you're gonna be able to see is your reflection so um i'm still getting my subwoofers put on tomorrow it's monday right now and tomorrow's tuesday so i'll be getting these installed i'm looking very excited i'm excited to see how it's going to sound so um yeah the car's coming out great so far and uh that's about it for right now see you guys tomorrow not for real that way yeah all right guys welcome back so i finally got the subwoofers put on it's now tuesday and look they that's a trunk takes a long time to open but there they are and man these these, these are so loud I'm, I'm just stop the video right here and i'm gonna put in the two clips that i recorded on snapchat and show you guys is how loud these are I honestly did not expect them to be this loud. Like these are much louder than the uh, kicker subs that I had in my Hyundai. I don't know if it's just because I have a better sound system in this car or what. I mean, they're they're both, I mean, these are, I, I had the kicker subs were 12 inch dual subs as well. And these are dual 12 inch subs. Uh, I think it was the same. I, I don't know. I can't remember if I had 2,400. I know these are 2,400 watts, but I don't know if I, if the uh, kicker subs were 1,200 or 2,400. But um, either way, th these are way much louder and the like because what the, the kicker subs like when i would get out the car like you couldn't actually hear the car you couldn't hear it from outside the car like especially with the trunk open but um but this one is like my as you can see my whole trunk was shaking so like i highly recommend scar audio uh this was very worth it, it, this the, the the full kit with the amplifier and the subs was just 500 bucks off amazon i'll put the link in the description that was very worth it for the money this i, I highly recommend the brand I, I was seeing them on instagram a lot like in my explore page so i just decided to you know give them a shot because i think they're like a new brand and they got some high quality products so i would definitely recommend them i'm, I'm loving them so far and um yeah i'm loving my tent as well and i'm i'm actually thinking about getting a wrap i don't know if i told you guys on yesterday but 
the place that I got my tent done at, they actually do wraps as well. And they told me it'd only be like twelve hundred dollars and like for whichever one I want. They just gotta order the the um the the you know the kit for it. So I'm thinking about going with like a space a space wrap. Like it's going basically I mean you if you look up a uh, car space wrap, like the first one I think it's like of a, a Camaro or a Mustang or something like that. That's the type that I want, like with all the stars and like all of it. Oh a bee. Y'all I almost just got stung just now. I don't even know where it went. Anyways, um, so yeah, I'm definitely gonna probably do that wrap very soon. And other than that, I'm pretty much done mining. Like I said, that was all. That was basically the all essentials that I needed: my subs, my rims, um, my t my tent. That, that's that's all I need. Really needed. So I'm pretty much done mining the car. That's that's pretty much it. Uh, but of course, if there's more, I would definitely make sure to bring you guys along. So make sure you guys click the subscribe button down below. Also, make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at the real Lomar. Follow me on Snapchat, whoa Lomar. And yeah, no, for real, <laughs> that way, yeah. Pull out my dick and smack across the dome. Across the dome. Swipe to the right, and then I press record. Yeah. Cause baby girl, we finna make.